is people start programming their V5 robots with the VEX coding studio. Two commands which are often questioned are the motor rotate 4 and the motor rotate 2. In this video we're going to do a simple little exercise you can try which hopefully will illustrate the difference between those two commands. Let's start out first with the VEX C++ program. And I'm going to bring over a motor for my arm. And assign that to the standard port for the claw bot. The arm port would be motor port 8. Then let's get right to the commands. And try the motor rotate 4. Now this will be for the arm motor. And we'll leave that at rotating 90 degrees. Now remember it's actually the small 12 tooth gear on your arm which rotates the 90 degrees to lift the arm. So let's have our program pause for a moment. So let's use a task sleep and we'll have that pause for a second. Then we'll try the rotate four again. This time we'll have our arm motor rotate for 180 degrees. We'll take another pause. And then rotate the arm one more time. And this time we'll do it for 90 degrees. So let's have that arm motor set to rotate 90 degrees. We'll save our program as test rotate 4. Save that in my example pro programs. And then we'll <laughs> compile and download to our robot. Let's see what this program does. As you saw, the arm rotated up for a short distance. Then it rotated double that distance for the 180 degrees. And then it repeated the 90 degrees once again and rotated that distance up once more. Now let's see what happens if we change our command to the rotate two command. So we'll go through and change our fours to twos. Change the name of our test to test rotate two. We'll put this in the second program spot and then compile and download to our robot. Now let's see how this change to the program affects the robot. To recap what you just saw, the robot's arm rotated up shortly, 90 degrees. Then it rotated up the same distance again which would be 180 degrees of rotation. 
Then it rotated back down to the 90 degree location. So in other words, with motor rotate two, the motor is rotating to a specific set point or a specific degree. This is different than the motor rotate four where the motor will rotate for a certain number of degrees and then it will rotate again for another certain number of degrees. We hope this little activity helps you understand the motor commands rotate two and rotate four. As a parting thought, if you're going to go to some place, we hope you remember what you went for.